Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. All right, Altano is supposed to be meeting me somewhere here at the Ragged Flagon. For some reason I don't see him. All right, Delvin. What gives with that case of shadow banners you sold me? Who do you mean? That boy tastes finer than anything Cyrilli brothers ever made. Sure, it tastes great. Only one problem. You said it can make the darkness as clear as day when you drink it. Guess what? It doesn't. But my responsible if the vintage was off on mm. that case. So he's in the Sorry. rat way. You know the rules, Mickle. Uh-oh. What's triggering my enchantment? Skeevers, which is waiting. Hopefully, I haven't contracted a disease. Somebody's down here with a bow. What? True Nords never back down! I cannot best them. No, you can't. Walk always in the light, or we will drag you to it. Who is this? This vagrant? And who was he shooting arrows at? Is someone there? Oh boy, who is it now? Really, another vagrant? I've had enough of you. Oh, I don't think so. None escape the vigil. All come into the light. So it seems that Altana was never in the rat way. Look at you creeping around here. All right. Did you find out anything about the Daedra summoning in the Ratway? I heard a Khajiit called Giovanni summoned it. Find that Khajiit while I search for the Daedra. Very well. Now I'm headed back in the Ratway. Triggered my enchantments. Here. Help! Seriously? Help! 
walk always in the light. Oh. 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 What happened? Where am I? I'm standing on someone's bed. Excuse me. Giovanni. What? Giovanni. Wake up, Giovanni. It is morning. Who are you? Why do I seem to know that your name is Campanara? What is it? Get up, Giovanni. Breakfast is ready. All right. Campanara. This one is awake. This one made your favorite tomato soup today. For breakfast? It will get cold if you do not eat it quickly. Hmm. Very well. Do I look like Giovanni to anyone? I didn't think so. That was delicious, even through the helmet. Is there something more that you want to say? Sit down, Giovanni. It is bad manners to eat while standing. Ugh, well, I've already eaten. Today's soup is delicious. This one is sure you will like it. All right. It's all right. It was good. So, Khajiit is merely jesting, Kampanara. Enough. Soup is getting cold. Wait, Kampanara. She's gone. Wait, who's this? What is go- That must be having some sort of delusion. Who- who are you? Pretty pelt, such a pretty pelt, so very, very pretty. Your Marso, I know that name, but I don't know how. But why would you? Why? Campanera would not look at Marso. But Marso wants to be with Campanera. So you killed her. Giovanni will never forgive you, Marso. Jealous, Giovanni? Jealousy makes one ugly. Marso used to be ugly, but no more. Campanera is with him now. Goodbye, Giovanni. Marso and Campanera are going on a journey. With Campanera, Marso will not be cold, even in wintry Skyrim. What's going on? Who are you? Life seems to be fading away. For no reason in particular. What? What? Oh! oh. I, I fainted again. What sort of sorcery is this? Uh, 
Another of these red stone pieces. And look at this, a red cat ring. Unarmed strikes do 55 additional damage. <laughs> and skooma, of course. to go from here. Take Campanara's pelt from Marso. Where is Marso? around here somewhere. lives that I killed earlier. I can sense that... Oh, he's very close. Or not. How do I get over there? Ah, here you are. Marso. I want Campanara's pelt. Campanara is warm. Marso is happy. Very happy. Marso, right. You have something that doesn't belong to you. Return Campanara. Now. No! Guys, you will never do this! Marso and Campanera are finally together! Why do you disturb us? Marso hates you! You smell like jealousy! Like Giovanni! Marso hates Giovanni! Seriously? Do you know who I am? Alright, well that hurt. Stop fighting me. It's the only way this was going to end. Now you have something that doesn't belong to you. Oh, look at this. A black cat ring double sneak attack damage with one-handed weapons. Here it is, Campanara's pelt. Another piece of redstone. All right, now, where is Giovanni? He should be dead, but... <laughs> From the strangeness that's going on here, I suppose that's... Not actually. Oh, what happened? Oh, he's still dead. So, I believe I need to plant the pet. 
held on his corpse. it. Altano, I sorted out that matter with the Khajiit. Defeated his Daedra, too. Indeed. I'm glad to have such an excellent partner. Let's return to Stendar's beacon. Perhaps the summoner's been caught already. All right. Oh, my I can only hope. Well, you won't let mercy we need something? <coughs> All right, here we are at the beacon. What? Or oh, Nern. Stop. Not a step further. These are some of our vigilant. We sent some vigilants after you and the summoner. What did you do to them? Those chasers. I killed them. They're probably food for trolls somewhere now. Jesus, some of our vigilant. Why did you attack the beacon? I'm only doing my job. Is that a good enough reason for you? <laughs> no. And if we don't stop, what will you do then? Then I will cut you down like all the others. If you don't want to die, leave. Leave! I am sure you have someone who waits for your safe return. There he is. I couldn't even see him before. Well, Altano, are you ready? Can't believe... These are our vigilant. Not the pretenders. Right, sir. You leave us no choice. Where'd you come from? Oh, that was a strong blow. He's down already. One less monster in the world. There. Sounded like Isran. Huh. All right, well. No choice at all. The summoner's mercenary is carrying a cursed greatsword. 
Well, gold. A letter from. Is it Car Karen? Carrie? Anyway, let me. What does this say? Dear Taranis, in your previous letter you mentioned finding someone who could lift your curse. But I have a bad feeling about this. Please promise me you'll be careful. P.S. Lillian made you a flower crown. I pray you will return to us before the flowers wither. And here's another letter. Oops. I'll have to read that potion of true shot. And vagrant armor. Suppose this could be displayed. And a wedding ring. Hmm. All right, this poor tyrannous fellow. All right, let me read the other letter. Letter from Lillian. Lillian. Dear Papa, I made flower crowns today. One was for you. Please get well soon and come back home. Hmm. So this man was cursed. It seems as though he was forced to fight us against his will. And now these poor vigilant. Let me pray for them. Mighty Stendar, carry these brave souls to your warm and divine embrace. I don't see you praying to Stendar. Well, I suppose we have no choice but to go forward. Still can't believe these vigilant. Is this where Jacob is? Is that Jacob? Jacob? Uh, what happened here? We were attacked by the summoner. Everyone is dead but me. Again. Again. I'm the only one who survived. The Daedra called her Bull. Such a sinister name. She must be serving Moloch Bull. Her goal can only be the altar underground. What do you mean? There's an altar under the beacon? There is an ancient altar of Molag Ball under the beacon. Molag Ball? She's trying to do something terrible. We must stop her. Help, Master Jacob. I'll scout ahead. Are you people serious? Molag Ball. Under the Temple of Stendar. What? Explain yourself. Daedric Prince of Domination and Enslavement. Many vigilants were corrupted by him. Apparently so. I'm 
One of them. What? By the divines. I was dying and he appeared to me and offered to heal me in exchange for my wife's soul. Are you mad? And I... I accept it. No. It is my greatest regret. I will never forget the look in her eyes. I bet you won't. You called that woman Baal. Tell me about her. Moloch Baal must have given her power. Hmm. Her magic is immensely powerful. No, infinite. She looks exactly like my dead wife. Just another trap by Moloch Ball, I'm sure. All right, then. Huh. Corrupted by Moloch Ball. I can't be begin to tell you how disappointed I am. Mighty Stendar, grant me your strength and divinity. All right, let's go. I'm not sure there's much sense in me pretending to be a a dawn guard. Be gone, Moloch Paul. What? I will not yield to you. Are you You're kidding right. me? I lost to you once, but this time I will overcome you. Stendar's light isn't even touching you. You are corrupt. All right, let's keep moving. Do you hear that? Some sinister, eerie sound coming from the depths. Exactly. I killed you. I killed innocents in the name of Stendar. Don't look at me like this. Please. I beg you. It's impossible. Stendar's light will not embrace you. Shut up, murderer. I'm not like you. I'm not a monster like you! What? He's resisting! What are you? I need to watch my back. It wasn't me. Oh, here he goes again. I'm not again. responsible for your death. Please, leave me alone. I don't know how a man can suffer as much as you have. You've completely gone off the, the beaten path. Not even my healing arts affect you. None of my divine magic does. You are beyond my power to even heal you. I've, I've Joshua. never been so... Joshua, is that you? I'm glad to see you. Shaken. Where were you hiding? Thank you, Joshua. Your words are kind. But I can't stop now. There's no Joshua here. Is it 
My imagination, but is he taking a threatening posture? Is this some sort of a trap? I warn the both of you. Master, I... Uh, I never thought I'd see you again. Yes, I understand. You understand what? Alright, well I suppose it's time to go inside then. Oh, Stendar, help me. Believe this. A complete area under Stendar's beacon devoted now to Molag Ball. It seems I spared not just one, but two more souls. What's the matter, Jacob? I. I'm here to make up for my crimes. No. Who are you? No. Raella, I'm, I'm here to save you. Well, you're a bit late for that. Ball. The summoning ritual is almost done. Molok Bal is coming. What? He will end it all and shroud everything in red mist. Well? Enough talking. You're disturbing the ritual. Orth, Ranyu, what take ritual? care of our guests. Whenever you two are finished. All right, Ball. There, she's finished. Wait, a ghost. Well, well, is that you? What happened, Jacob? Why are you yelling? Did you have a yelling? Yes. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought I lost you. I'll never leave you alone again. Jacob, I will always be with you. It's all right. Ah, uh, Rael. What? Oh, this man is finally at peace. I don't think I've ever seen anyone suffer this much. You've gotten awfully quiet, Altano. All right, what does he have? Suppose I'll continue to collect these amulets. This vigilant sword, this is interesting. Now, I wanted to check out Ball. Hmm, even carrying the mace of Molag Ball. More redstone. And pilgrim attire. Ra, ra, whatever. Her journal. Two days have passed since Jacob went to Windhelm underground to hunt down the vampires. My heart is sinking. I'm worried he won't return safely. I. I woke up at our house. It is in ruins. Looks like Jacob no longer lives here after betraying me. Nausea simply won't go away, it hurts so much. One of Molag Bal's followers visited and gave me a mace. When I touched it, I felt a surge of power and knowledge of magic flowing into my mind. The follower of Molag Bal ordered me to spread the seeds of discord in this land. 
I gave a potion that causes lycanthropy to a little girl with a sick father. What? After a while, I heard screaming from the house. I thought I'd gotten used to this and wouldn't feel so guilty anymore. But still... I met a man who lost his daughter and was drinking his life away in the taverns. I taught him a Daedra summoning ritual and told him he can get in touch with his daughter that way. The smile on his face, I can't stop thinking about it. He looked so happy. Everyone I've tricked had smiled like that. It was such a pleasant smile. As was that man. I wonder if he's still smiling somewhere. All right, so the writing becomes hasty. The dates are missing. I can't believe it. Someone stole my mace. I'll never forgive that thief. I'll send him screaming to oblivion. Summoning Vinacus was a mistake. I can't believe he used a blast spell in that tiny shack. The city guards and the vigilance of Stendar will notice this for sure. I left Vinacus behind. Maybe this idiot can still buy me some time. Huh. This werewolf thing. Could that be the man at the temple? No. So what does this necklace do? 25% magic resistance. 24. What did I say? Whatever. Okay. Reanimate a greater corpse. Hmm. All right. I'll take the magic resistance. Maybe I can give it as a gift. And let's see what we have here. More Daedra hearts and a battle axe. Not giving that as a gift. And a sword. All right. You seem like you have something on your mind. It's over. It's all over. Bring yeah. me the mace Bal was using. We'll need it. All right. I'll return to the Temple of Stendar and ask the Keeper for advice about this mace. Before I leave, I have a small task for you. Very I heard there's well. a witch living with her child in the shack south of Iverstead. Witches are a serious threat in Skyrim. Indeed. Give them the mercy of Stendar. Hmm. Well, I hear you, but shouldn't we hold a funeral for Jacob first? I will do it. You just take care of the witches in the meantime. I'll see you at the Temple of Stendar. All right. Poor man. Stendar take you. There's nothing I can do. You're immune to all of my divinity. Good luck. I think we're all going to need it. 